I'm hearing reservations. Ten yards out for you? Come on, man. It's like hitting the side of a barn. I won't be the shooter. My sister will be. Me? Five bucks. One shot. You're on. Growing up in a soccer family had its plus and minuses for Elizabeth and Andrew Shu, <laughs> whose dad captained the Harvard College soccer team in 1958. All the kids wore the number seven on their jerseys that their father wore, and they were coached and drilled in the backyard of their New Jersey home and expected to perform. Andrew and Elizabeth say they were most definitely measured by how they played. Well, see, our dad was never kind of the coach of our teams, but he was definitely somebody who was playing with us all the time, and our competitive spirit definitely comes from him. Uh, he, he's a little different than the dad in the film. He's not kind of as overbearing, uh, where you would feel like you're playing for him, uh, but he's somebody who, uh, when you're out there in the yard, you know, you're playing to win. Yeah, and you're playing to get his attention, for sure. Just because we looked up to him so much and wanted to be like him. So, uh, me especially, being the only girl in a family of three brothers, sports was the way that you proved yourself in, in my family and getting his attention was what you wanted to do. Andrew went on to play at Dartmouth College and later for the Los Angeles Galaxy, while Elizabeth played for her hometown teams from ages 9 to 13. They both have vivid memories of their most celebrated soccer moments. The one that's most meaningful to me is uh, the game that was dedicated to my brother my senior year in college where we all wore armbands and, and I scored two goals in the game uh, and my whole family was there watching. It was just a month after he had died so uh, it was incredibly meaningful and just you know, just something that uh, felt a little bit out of this world to be honest. I would say the first day I showed up on the field and a little boy took my ball away and said that girls can't play soccer. And even though I walked off the field in tears, I did walk back on the field and I did stay. And um, I'm proud that I, that I didn't quit. I scored a few goals, definitely yeah. took a few guys out. <laughs> <laughs> Andrew pays tribute to his soccer coach in Gracie, who is known as Coach C, by giving the film's high school coach the same name. I didn't mean you. Watch this. Top corner. Good, but not good enough.